Farming Friday, y'all. We got three houses to look at today, so let's get on to the first one. First property here. This one's a three bedroom, one bath, 1,080 square feet. Let's take a ride. Inside. Just walk inside the property and you're welcome into your living area. And I do like how it's an open floor plan for an older home. That's really nice. On the left hand side, you have bedroom number one that faces the street. Looks like a shared closet. Dining areas here. And then here is bedroom number two. And that definitely is a shared closet space. Moving along into your kitchen. And this is actually a pretty large kitchen for the size of the home, wow. So decent sized kitchen as well. And then here is bedroom number three. And this is actually not a legit bedroom because there is no closet. There is a window, but no closet. Moving along over here, you have your full bath. And then I believe this is access to the backyard over here. Do you have a deck out the back? So you have a deck. Nice backyard. And then this is a shed where your washer and dryer go. So you gotta go outside to do your laundry. Not fully outside, but close enough. So if anyone's interested in this property, it's a three bedroom, one bath. 1,080 square foot home, built in 1904, going for 395 in the downtown Renton area. On to the next one, guys. All right, we are our next property here. This one's a three bedroom, two and a half baths, 2710 square feet. Let's All right, just walk inside the property here. So much, right? You have a storage closet. And then on my left, you have your coat closet. Moving along into your half bath right at the front door. Interesting. Opening up into your living space with them Lake Washington views. Check that out. Sky's getting a lot clearer, all that smoke that was out here. Moving along into your kitchen. And these are granite countertops and oak cabinets. Check out this range. Magic Chef. It's old. Usually I'll go outside, but since it's raining, I would walk out on that deck, but we're not doing that today. But you have this large deck out here. And as you can see, tons of Lake Washington views. Just amazing. Since we're over here already, we're gonna go downstairs. And at the bottom of the stairs, you do have your laundry area, washer and dryer there. Here is a family room that goes out to the backyard. As you can see, oh, there's a car there. How did it get there? Not sure. Over here is your utility room with your furnace and your water heater and also access to the back of the home again. Kind of redundant. Very dark and gloomy in here. Definitely needs more windows. On this side, oh, there's a garage. So you gotta go all the way around to the back to get in the garage. So this is your garage area. 
and it looks like a tandem style, which is nice. So it gives you at least some more space to do, put two cars in there. Now going back upstairs, the so views are amazing. Going towards the front of the home, I definitely, if I could, open up this wall just to make it feel more grand right when you first walk in. Here's your first bedroom, and this is your primary. As you can see, you do have this big shower here. You got your vanity on that side. Then you have your closet here. Not a huge closet, but big enough. Then we're gonna go upstairs. And to my left, you have bedroom number, actually no, is this a bedroom? Whoa, hold on. I guess it is a bedroom. So you have an open bedroom here, number two. Then you go around, you have another Three quarter bath here with a shower. And then here is your third bedroom. Very interesting. So only one official bedroom. These other two are open. So if anyone's interested in this property, it's a three bedroom, two and a half baths, 2710 square foot home. Built in 1939, going for 875 in the Lake Ridge area. On to the right, next one. We're at our last property here. This one's a four bedroom, two full baths, 1,280 square feet. Let's take a All look. All right, just walk inside the property here. And walking into your first bedroom, this is the primary suite. I believe this was a garage conversion just by where it's located. Here is your primary bath. Moving along into your living space here. Nice and bright, even on this gloomy day. You got a wood burning fireplace there. Front yard. Here is your dining area. And then here is your kitchen. And this is a galley style kitchen. You got stainless steel appliances, quartz countertops, and these are not really shaker cabinets. These are more of a traditional style, but not too traditional. Washer and dryers also in the kitchen area. And then over here you have your electrical panel, water heater, and furnace. Moving along, we got here, I think this is a side door to go to your backyard. It is, and there is a shed back there. It's raining, so we're not gonna do that here. So now we're gonna head to the back of the home here. I believe this is the original portion. Here's bedroom number two. There's the closet. Here is your full bath. Here is bedroom number three. And then here is bedroom number four. So if anyone's interested in this property, it's a four bedroom, two full baths, 1,280 square foot home built in 1966, going for $599,950 in the upper Rainier Beach area. And that's it for Farm Friday this week.